Hey everyone, it's Mandy from Daydream Face Painting. Today I'm going to show you this cute cupcake design using this, the Krivlin Rainbow Cake in the color Flirty. So if you'd like to see how I did this, keep watching. So first I've loaded up my sponge with some Superstar Baby Pink Shimmer and I'm going along the forehead and the top of the cheekbone with that. I've loaded up the smaller of my two Protégé flat brushes with purple and white and I'm pulling two lines down and then flipping my brush over and two more lines down for the cupcake wrapper. And next for the frosting, I'm using the creamy magenta on the bottom and the creamy white on the top. I've just double loaded my brush and I'm pulling it in and twisting at the edge to make the frosting shapes. And next I'm using Krivlin Metallic Red on a number one brush just to make a little cherry on top of the cupcake. Now I'm coming in with some of the Krivlin Dark Purple from the cake and outlining the cupcake, just a zigzag at the top. And then I'm gonna come along and make the little lines coming down just to give the illusion of a cupcake wrapper. And I decided I didn't like the curvy zigzag line at the bottom so I just straightened it out. Now I'm going to be using some iridescent purple cosmetic glitter on a damp brush and I'm just coming along and dabbing it on the cupcake wrapper. And next I've loaded up some DFX white on my number one brush and I'm just going to add some highlights to the frosting. And now I'm going to come in with some of the creamy light magenta and just go along the edges of the bottoms of the frosting swirls, just for a little extra depth. I loaded my sponge with some of the creamy light magenta and the white from the cake and I'm using my BAM Stencil 1039 to add some multicolor stars to the design. Next, I'm going to add the Afterglow Cosmetic Glitter in the color Iridescent Pink to the frosting and also to the stars. And next, to add some swirls and curls to the design, I'm using Diamond Effects White on a number one Low Cornell Yellow Handle Brush. And I'm just making a swirl up underneath the cupcake and one coming down around the cheek. And I'm just dragging the tip of my brush and dropping it to make those little teardrop shapes. So I drag it and push down, drag and push down. And I'm going to continue doing that up the swirl in the direction that it's flowing up my forehead. So drag the tip very lightly and push down. Drag it lightly and push down. And next, I'll just fill in some of the empty spaces with little dots. Just make sure your brush is really well loaded with your white to do those. And now I'm going to add a few starbursts throughout the design too to give it a magical feel. And for the finishing touch, I'm just adding some pink gems in a star shape to the stars on my design. And that's it. That's the finished look. I hope you guys like this and you can try it out at your next event. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.